how can you protect yourself from becoming the next victim of cybercrime? It's easier than you think. Cybercrime is criminal activity that targets your computer or networked devices. The usual goal of cybercriminals is to steal money. Whatever the reason, cybercriminals can't touch the personal data on your computer and networked devices if they are properly secured, and if you're wise to their tactics. Here are seven ways to protect yourself against cybercrime. Number one, keep your operating system and software updated. It may seem like you just updated them, but the latest updates contain security patches and bug fixes that the previous update did not. Think about it this way. What is the use of a lock if a criminal has the key? The update is your new lock. Number two, use antivirus software. This allows you to scan, detect, and remove threats before you become a victim. And as always, keep your antivirus updated for the best level of protection. Number three, never underestimate the power of a strong password. We know, it's a pain to think of a password numbers that contains the right amount of upper and lowercase letters, and special characters that's not your favorite song, first pet, or mother's maiden name. So make use of a highly rated password manager that generates strong, random passwords and keeps them safely locked away. Number four, never open attachments or click on links in spam or emails from people you don't know. This could expose your computer or computer network to dangers such as malware, which comes in a variety of forms. Trojans are malicious code designed to steal, disrupt, or damage data. Phishing is a fraudulent message designed to trick a person into revealing information such as account numbers and passwords. Ransomware is malware that locks up your data or device and holds it for ransom until you pay to have it unlocked. DDoS, or Distributed Denial of Service, is a network attack that floods a website or server to prevent real users from using it. Data breaches are when networks or computer systems are compromised by malware to expose confidential information to unauthorized persons. Number five, never give out personal information over the phone or via email, unless you are 100% certain the line or email is secure. If you are asked for personal information from a company who has contacted you, even if it's about employment, hang up. Call the number on the official website to ensure you are communicating with them and not a cybercriminal. It's best to use a different phone because cybercriminals can hold the line open. When they do this, even if you think you've dialed the official number, they can still pretend to be from that organization. Number six, look before you click on a URL. Ads and links are meant to entice you to click on them, so you must be extra cautious if the URL looks unfamiliar or looks spammy. Once you land on a suspicious site, your computer or device could be susceptible to malware. Number seven, protect your bank account by making online purchases only through secure websites. Don't forget to check your bank statements for unfamiliar activity that may be fraudulent. You can protect yourself from cybercrime by using Kaspersky products an award-winning comprehensive internet security systems that instantly neutralizes dangers with proactive, real-time monitoring. Links in the description.